Hey, how you doing? This is Matt Criscuola coming to you up close and personal, as you can see right there. And uh, by the way, I'm going to be doing uh, the Beatles across the universe. Now, this is uh, some 1969 rare stuff. I don't know. It's obviously not the original recording, but, you know, this is going out to my friend Jerry Tyler, by the way. He's my uh, one of my best friends. Uh, and a wealth of knowledge uh, about music of all types of music and an incredible bassist on top of that. But uh, you and me and a handful of other people know it because uh, because Jerry likes to stay home a lot. And uh, and I don't blame him, actually. But uh, if you ever heard him play and watched him, you would not believe what you were seeing and hearing. It's that kind of stuff. It's like, what? So anyway, this is uh, The Beatles. Let's check it out, huh? Mm-hmm. It's trippy. I mean, these lyrics, words are flowing out like endless rain into a paper cup. They slither wildly as they slip away across the universe. Pools of sorrow, waves of joy are drifting through my open mind, possessing and caressing me. I mean, that's some heavy stuff, man. That's beautiful. Did John Lennon write that? I mean... I wish you, I, I didn't, you know, I would love to hear more about the song. You know, I, I could look it up, but I want you guys to tell us about it because it's more exciting that way. You know, who wrote this and the lyrics and the music and what's the story behind it? What is it about? Uh, and um, and what do we know? Let us know, please. Put that in the, uh, in the uh, comment section below. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, please look at the description below. You can you know, become a Patreon member, buy me a cup of coffee or do a PayPal and support the channel that way. Uh, if you like to, that would be nice. Wow, that's pretty cool. And I love the sound. It was so clear. Man, nothing's going to change my world. Sounds of laughter, shades of life are ringing through my open ears, inciting and inviting me. Limitless, undying love, which shines around me like a million suns. It calls me on and on across the universe. 
I think you got to be doing more than just smoking something like this to to know where that's all coming from. But that's beautiful stuff, man. Great, great. That was a great job for humanity. The Beatles never cease to amaze me. I'll tell you, one of the greatest bands of all time, if not, yeah, it's hard to say the greatest because there's a lot of greatest out there. You know, Miles Davis's, uh, you know, band from 1964 was, you know, intense. Uh, the Beatles, right over here, 1969. Jesus, just wonderful stuff. And so thank you to my friend Jerry Tyler. Uh, I'm going to do some reaction to, to his music too, actually, one of these days. And uh, you'll get it. You, you'll know what I'm talking about. But uh, this was just wonderful. Anytime I can review, I mean, react to the Beatles is, I want to do more of it. But a lot of these videos, they get blocked. And I don't even know if you're going to see this at some point. Maybe. I don't know. Hopefully soon. But they're just uh, heavily copyrighted, obviously. But um, but great, great music. So melodic. And, you know, for somebody like me, I'm a musician, but I like chords. I like harmony. That's, that's an important thing for me. I, I, of course, rhythm as well. Uh, all that stuff. But I, I love unpredictability in music. And I like, you know, even if it's not unpredictable, I like creatively uh, organized chords. Um, you know, that's, that's, you know, like the, the Beach Boys did that. The Beatles did that. Uh, a lot of great groups did that. Super Tramp, you know, but um, yeah, this was wonderful. So much enjoyed it. I'd like to know what you think about uh, the Beatles. Um, what does this song mean to you? What were you doing in 69? Uh, and I'm talking about the year. Uh, and what, uh you know, what kind of thoughts and, 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 and feelings and images and memories does it bring to you? If you care to share, let us know. Hey, look, it's nice to be important, but it's more important to be nice. And you take it easy. And if it's real easy, take it twice.